Time now for showbiz and CEO of Charter House, Teresa Ayoade, is calling on government to put in place measures that will make it easy for the creative industry to assess funding. In a yet-to-be-aired interview on PM Personality Profile, she told me that funding has been the biggest challenge over the period. Managed several creative platforms. Yes. Obviously, the VGMA, yeah. a thousand and mm. how thousand many? Laughs, a thousand laughs. The music series. Loves and me, yeah. Yes. And then and uh, Miss Malaika, Malaika um, and all of this. All of that, what yeah. would you describe as the some of the inhibitions in these areas? Well, um, I it's been a joy. First of all, having worked in this industry for about twenty five years and beyond. Um, it's been interesting seeing, we've, we've done a lot of work in talent discovery and talent um, promotion and it's been a joy to see that through our handiwork um, a lot of um, talents have been discovered and have been projected and have a lot of careers, a lot of young people have discovered um, their own talents and have been able to forge a career in the creative um, space. So that's something we are very happy and very proud of. Um, having worked in the industry, obviously you come across um, challenges. I mean, before I entered the industry, I didn't even know of the challenges of the problems. But af as you work in the industry, you get to see the issues firsthand and um, begin to think of how you can solve them. One of the major things, we challenges we faced when we started was um, lack of um, logistics and infrastructure for the kind of things we wanted to do <laughs> there was no logistics yeah. virtually none available and I remember the first few events and concerts we had to do we had to bring in the kind of logistics we needed we had to bring them in from neighboring countries okay they had to come in by road stage wow. things like stages <laughs> and, and light Has a full interview at 9 p.m. on the Journeys channel and they repeat at 9 a.m. Sunday. Now, chairperson for the United Concerned Members of Gamera, Kosie Japan, has given the CEO of Gamera, Abraham Ajete, a two day ultimatum to provide proof to an allegation he made against her. Speaking at a press conference organized by the group in Accra earlier today, Akosia Japon said Abraham had alleged that she had formed a new group for spinners and was taking royalties from them. Um, he, on, one, on the other thing, with the, with the press conference that they did, Abraham Ajete came to say on authority that I have set, I have actually set, I, 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 no, I have registered um, a company that is a spinners association and they are collecting money for me and, and he said he, he said I'm saying it on authority that a country Japan has, has formed a as um, spinners association and they are collecting money for me and I haven't done that and I, I will never also do that because I'm the same person who is telling them not to pay so I don't know why I'm telling them not to pay and I'll form an association so I'm giving them for, I'm giving them my 48 hours if it doesn't come back to show the papers I should have registered and and doesn't come back to come and apologize. I'm telling you, he'll meet me in court. And I mean it because he, he's, he's trying to spoil my name and I don't want that. Speaking about the Attorney General's decision not to renew Gamera's license and the need to sanitize the organization, Akosia Japan said the only way to make Gamera work is for the AG to call for mediation between the two parties. Um, Rex rightly said on one of the star stations, um, he, he, he actually said that um, the way they are even exceeding the, the money that they are supposed to use, the allowance can be taken from them. Now, since, since 3rd April 2022, the allowance was taken away from them because they didn't do the right thing. And the right thing needs to be done. So, till the right thing is done, the allowance will not be given to them. So, according to Rex Omar, they still have the power to take royalties but they can't distribute. What do you say to that? No, it's not right. You cannot collect royalties without license. You cannot collect royalties. If you do that, as we show you, we showed you the, um, how do you call it, um, the ally showing that without, without license you cannot collect. So you cannot collect and put it down. You are supposed to collect and share and let us know the money that you are collecting. They are not doing it. Uh, at the same time, they are, over, they are, they are supposed to be between 10 
and 30%, they are not doing that. So the alliance will not be given to them until we go back to the mediation report and then everything will start taking its shape. You have given Abraham Ajate, the CEO, 48 hour ultimatum. What has he done? And as I wrap up, show base, that's how we.